metabolic conditioning. This is going to be the, for the community workout challenge as well as my youth session and my athletes at home. Um, so this is all just one workout you guys can all do either as a family or individually, doesn't matter. So first you're going to go through your warm-up. If you're not sure what the warm-up is, I posted a video yesterday on what our warm-up looks like, what I, what I am looking for out of that. And you guys can do that first and then get right into the workout. So the workout is going to be 10 minutes. Um, it's 20 mountain climbers, 20 kettlebell swings, uh, 20 air squats, and then a 50 meter shuttle. So uh, mountain climbers, you guys are going to get into a push-up plank just like this. And all I'm going to do is I'm going to run my knees or run my feet to my chest. Okay. And every time you raise a knee, that's one, that's two, you're going to do 20. So it's 10 on each side. Then you're going to do 20 uh, kettlebell swings. So let me grab my backpack. For those of you who don't know, you guys can hold on to the backpack on the side, or you guys can hold on to it from the edge right here, fill it up with some water bottles or some books. There's my dog again. And you guys just pick it up, let it swing back, use your hips, dive your dog, and continue to use your hips and drive your hips forward to get that kettlebell to swing up to eye level. After that, you guys have 20 air squats. Um, so for that, you're just going to set your feet about shoulder width apart. Sit your butt back and your knees out, just like this, and that's two reps. Um, a couple keys for that is keep your chest up, keep your core tight, and make sure your knees are outside of your big toes when you go down. <clears throat> the 50 meter shuttle, okay, is just gonna be, you're gonna walk out 50 steps, 50 big steps, maybe in your neighborhood or in your yard, wherever you're gonna do it at, and you're gonna sprint that 50 meters and then sprint it back, and then you restart it. So. This can burn a little bit, but it's for 10 minutes. So as long as you keep moving, it doesn't really matter, right? So um, some of you guys may be able to sprint through this and get, I don't know, six or seven rounds between this whole entire deal. And some of you guys might not be able to sprint the 50 meter shuttle. Maybe you can only speed walk it, or maybe you can only walk it. That's totally fine. The idea is that you guys just continue to move for the whole entire 10 minutes, never stop to take a break, and just go at a pace that you can hold consistently. Um, I'll be posting a video of myself doing the workout later on today, but I want to get you guys this workout in the morning so you guys actually have time to do it and not at 8 o'clock at night. So, hope you guys all have a great day and I'll see you later.